Hey guys, it's Rune, the math person. Today I'll be going over question 155 on SOA exam P. So pause the video quick and try this problem yourself. Okay, assuming you, are, you already attempted it, let's just dive right in. So an automobile claim amounts are modeled by uniform distribution on 0,000, but then X is defined as a, a claim amount divided by 1,000, right? So if claim is going from 0 to 10,000, then x, which is x that they give you, is defined as 0 divided by 1,000, which is um, 0, 10,000 divided by 1,000, which is 10. So that's basically what it's saying. It's uniform on this interval. So we know that the fourth moment, e to the x fourth, is equal to from going from 0 to 10, x fourth times the probability function. For a uniform distribution, it is always b minus a. So in our case, it's going to be b, which is the upper limit, minus 0. So this is 1 tenth dx. So taking the derivative, this becomes x to the fifth divided by 50, integrating from 0 to 10. So this is equal to 2,000. So y is a little bit more complicated, right? So y is basically b, but just rounded to the nearest integer from 0 to 10. So let's say like you have, I really like how the best SOA solutions did it. I'm going to tag his video down below. But he said, let's say like it's going from like 0 to 0.5. Then this is going to be rounded to 0. And then the probability is going to be the inter interval length divided by 10. I really like how he did this one. So this is going to be 0 0.05. So let's say this is going from 0.5 to 1. This is actually going to get rounded up to 1, and the interval, the probability of this happening is also 0.05. And then going from 1 to 0.5, this is going to also be rounded down to, point, to 1, so this is going to be with the probability of 0.05, and so on and so on. So I'll do a little bit more. So if it's going from 1.5 to 2, it'll get rounded up to 2. If it's going from if it's going from two to one point five, two to two point five, we'll still get rounded down to two. So these are all probability 0 0.05, 0 0.05, and so on and so on. So you can see everything, but let's say you got got down to let's say nine. So going from nine to nine point five. This is going to get rounded down to 9. And from going from 9.5 to 10, this is going to be rounded up. 8.5 to 9 is going to get rounded up to 9. And expectation of y to the fourth moment is equal to um, 0 fourth times the probability of 0 fourth, which is 0.05 plus um, 1 fourth times the probability of 1 fourth, probability of 1, which is going to be 1, 0.1, plus 2 fourth times the probability that it's going to be 2, that's going to be 0.1, and that's going to be 0.1 until you get to 10. The probability of 10 fourth, probability of 10, is going to be 0 0.05. So essentially, you can factor out the 0.1 here. This is going to be 0, 0.1 times 1 fourth plus 2 fourth plus 3 fourth and so on so on so on until 9 fourth but 0 0.05 but 10 is going to have a different probability it's going to be have the probability of 0 0.05 times 10 to the fourth so this is equal to 20,033.3 so the difference between y and b Expectation of y minus b, or x, is equal to, going to be equal to 2033.3 minus 2000, which is your answer 33, which is your answer b. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Otherwise, as always, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Bye!